how are you? So welcome back. In today's video, I'm also going to be talking to you about Giorgio Armani's Lip Maestro collection. They sent it to me. They are on the creamy side, but they're not glosses. Even though the packaging seems like they're a gloss, they're not. I'm gonna be swatching them for you and showing you guys. This is the Lip Maestro Liquid Lipstick Mediterranean. Not Mediterranean, Mediterranean. It has six new shades that are infused with refined pearl pigment, ooh, that bring a subtle light capturing effect, echoing the way the sun sparkles on the Mediterranean Sea's surface. That is very beautiful, by the way, Norwegian Epic Cruise Adventures will be linked down below, but what I wanted to show you guys, um, so I really like the packaging, first of all, and the good thing about this product is that it's not a gloss. A lot of people don't like glosses, and that is because it's very sticky. Like my mom hates gloss. I love gloss, but this product, however, the formulas are on the creamy side, but it's like a very subtle shine. Like it's not something that is very intense. And then the colors are very neutral and some of them are dark and they have like little shimmery pigments, which I'm gonna show you in a bit. The first one that I'm gonna be showing you is the shade 109. And this is like a nude color. It has like little shimmers, I don't know if you can see. So I'm gonna apply it and I'm gonna tell you. So, there you have it. I really like it. I would wear this shade more like if, it's, if you're going into the office or if it's something during the day, then this is a beautiful color. Also, if you don't like to wear a lot of makeup, this is a beautiful color to have. I also really like the fact that it's very hydrating. It's not a formula, but it's like super dry. I think it's very beautiful and I think it complements a lot of complexions. The next shade that I'm gonna be sharing with you guys is the number 111. And this is more on the nude brown side. It has a brown undertone. Same formula, but this one is a not, it has no type of shimmer. So far, I really like that it's very easy to apply. It glides onto the lips very easily, and that's a huge plus. So I did have to go over the same area maybe twice because this is a very subtle color, very hydrating, really like the formula. So this is the second one. Let me know in the comments at the end which one is your favorite one. Now we are going to move into the darker shades and the shade that I'm gonna be sharing with you guys is number 110. This is the color right here. This is a very nighttime kind of liquid lipstick that you can wear. I would ideally wear this to a happy hour if I get invited or if I wanna go out with my friends and I want something that's a little bit more risque, more intense, more like in the afternoon time. It's still a very hydrating formula. It only took one coat for this color to show, which is really good. It is very subtle. If you are starting out with makeup and you want a dark shade to wear, this would be it. The next shade that I'm gonna be sharing with you guys is number 215 and this is an orangey type of color and it has shimmer. So let's try and see. My thoughts on this product are that yes, this is like a very beautiful color if you are into browns. I think this could be a daytime lipstick, even though it's a little bit darker. I think you can get away with it if you just wanna wear something like what I'm wearing right now. But this color, I really, really like. Now we are going to go on to the next product, and this one is number 532. Looks like this. I really like it because it has shimmer. This is a beautiful color. This is like a nighttime color, and let's see. My thoughts on this color are that yes, you do have to glide on the product more than one time, but aside from that, something that I'm noticing about this collection is that yes, it has that glowy effect and you can wear it now during the what's left of spring and of summer, but during the fall time, these colors are going to be incredible. 
Okay, so my camera stopped recording, but I did apply the shade right here. This is number 112. And I really like this formula, most of all, also because I keep saying that it's hydrating. But with the actual applicator, I was able to line my lips. And I think that is so important because sometimes, let's say you're in your car or something, you're not gonna have a lip liner on hand. And if you can line your lips with the applicator, then that is a huge plus. Or if you're into browns, like a lot of women are into like neutrals, browns, this would be a beautiful formula for you. So I do have a lip stain now because of all the products I've applied. But the next one that I wanna tell you about is number 531. This is a beautiful, it has like a very purplish undertone and it has a little bit of shimmer to it. So here you have it. This is another product that you can use. And as you guys can see, I was able to line my lips with the actual applicator. It is very hydrating. Yes, it has the same shimmer. And this is, in my opinion, a nighttime type of liquid lipstick that you can use. It is beautiful. And now lastly, I am going to be showing you guys number 216 this is a brown it has a red undertone and it's very it has a lot of shimmer so let's see what this color looks like this is the final shade this would be a nighttime type of lipstick i cannot see the shimmers i always pay attention to see if i see the shimmers but no what you're gonna find is a beautiful glow if you are not familiar with armani beauty they have the most beautiful collections in my previous video i showed you guys the foundation the setting powder concealer everything everything that you need to create a beautiful look in fact i am wearing it right now and that's why like you can see this glow on my skin i really like the combination of products because they are very hydrating thank you so much for watching today's video if you loved it please give it a thumbs up write me a comment subscribe and i will see you guys very soon take care bye